I'm Dr. David Adelson. I'm the vice chair for the Rockefeller Neuroscience Institute, also the executive director for the WVU Medicine Children's Neuroscience Center of Excellence. The brachial plexus is a series of nerves that go from your neck and provide the function to your arm that includes both the motor and the sensory function. So the brachial plexus is made up of five nerve roots that go from the neck down to the arm. When an injury occurs to those nerves, that's when you would lose motor or and or sensory function. We like to see the children as early as possible, but um, many times we're trying to determine whether the nerves are going to recover on their own or not. We usually make that determination by around three or four months after the injury. Kind of the sweet spot for determining surgery versus are we just going to continue to watch it is in that four to six, four to eight month range. Injuries to the nerves are very complex. This is not something that you would go to a local community hospital, a local community doctor and have it done. It's done in specialty centers that requires multiple disciplines. We need that type of team around us and that's why uh, we're very fortunate here at WVU Medicine and in a children's hospital to have these specialists available to us to be able to uh, not just assess uh, these children, but be able to provide non-surgical and surgical treatments in order to optimize or improve their long-term outlook. What we had here is we had a lot of the other specialists who could do other components of it, but to do this surgery, to be able to microscopically sew back the nerves back together requires a, uh, a level of specialization that didn't exist here, and, and, um, but also doesn't exist in many, many areas. And that's why you know, we've started seeing children and adults from not just West Virginia, but the surrounding states, as well as from across the country. Very important if you or your doctor or um, family uh, feel that things aren't right, that things aren't working, that you're not getting uh, the right information, then it's so important to seek out a peripheral nerve specialist, to find a specialty clinic that deals with these problems, get in with the clinic, make sure that you are advocating for yourself and your family.